Hey folks, and welcome back to the channel. Happy Catty Crypto here. So let's dive into a proposition 4080 update. Really um, put the nail in the coffin, so to speak, and uh, put it to rest and let everybody know that you can just relax. You don't need to worry about it. It is happening. And um, yeah, the community pool is gaining. We should be seeing a burn around a month from from around now we should expect that we will know when that first burn happens i'm pretty sure terror rebels will update us as to that first burn actually happening um so as to the community pool and moving over to it um we can go so if you want to view the community pool we need to come over to terror station if you do not have a terror station wallet you will need one i think to view this i might be wrong you might not need it but um, it's always good to have a Terra Station wallet anyway, so you can view the governance stuff because I know you definitely can't view that without a um, Terra wallet. So anyway, moving forward, as you can see, the community pool is at 10.60 million. And um, this has gone up uh, very, very um, steadily over the past few days. And it's it has been increasing, as you can see, because I've covered this in previous videos. Um, it shows its equivalent value in USTC which is really, really good because it's showing you the value of the stable coin itself. And uh, a lot of people don't recognize the USTC pool is actually in here as well with other coins that are also in this community pool. And uh, I think USTC is also increasing because looking back at my screenshots, it seems to have increased as well. So I would say without a doubt, like we've been told, it executed correctly. It was a parameter change proposal, so it was set to automatically execute. It was set for a block on the epoch. It's now reached that epoch by the looks of it, and the community pool is going up. And it's really important that we see the proof of this happening, even if it's uh, small amounts or large amounts or very minuscule amounts. We still need to make sure that the community knows that um, it is happening, and uh, the things that are being proposed and put forward as parameter change proposals are going through. And this shows you that terror rebels themselves have the ability to execute parameter change proposals. And it opens the door to so much more in the future, in my opinion. Um, so I've recently just done a video on Binance, pretty much covering uh, the fact that they're building up more and more coins, even through this price pump that we've seen. And right now the price is actually dumping because what a lot of people don't understand is, is when things shoot up all of a sudden like this, there's always someone waiting at the top to cash out. And this is just the way that things are. So as you can see, we're seeing that uh, price dump right now. It's it's not a huge dump, but it's, it's reasonable for how much it has pumped. This is normal. What we now want to see is it come down, uh, possibly hit this support line and hold this support line and then start tracking sideways again and sort of thinking about what it wants to do and where it wants to go. All three of these coins are the same, but moving over to the Binance wallet, I last refreshed it around half an hour ago. And as you can see, they've added a monumental amount. So they've added nearly 24 billion um, coins during this time. Is this a last ditch attempt for Binance? We do not know because we don't have a crystal ball and we do not know what their true intentions are. We can only speculate um, from a certain point onwards. And yes, the USTC accumulation has also increased. So if we quickly move over to this, just because of the fact I'm covering it quickly. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, folks. Well, there you go. Look, a very, very um, peculiar change of uh, events right there. There's no data available right now on the Terry Engineer for this exchange address and um the thing is as well is this is actually it says it's the exchange's address like all of these so yeah very interesting that that's not actually showing us any data see if we can get on kucoin no we cannot so something is clearly wrong with this site um moving back to the point of this video like i said folks do have um faith uh be patient have time don't put pressure on people to keep um, on at people in the Discord and um, just let these things happen. Give the people the time and the space that they need to develop these um, mechanisms, protocols, parameter changes, text proposals, because there's been two text proposals that have been passed. And uh, like I said to you, they have to be manually implemented. There's no way around it. 
And there might even be um, a parameter change proposal at some point regarding one of those text proposals because they may need to actually implement it as a parameter change. But that's all things to come. Uh, 356A is still in the testnet as far as I'm aware, folks. A lot of FUD is circulating saying, oh, testnet is nearly ready, blah, 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 blah. There's 50 validators in there, so on and so forth. And this is just not the case. It's a testnet and anybody can join it to test that um situation and as to time scales time frames terror rebels have never given us any time frames or any time scales unless it's been a parameter change where they can actually um like guesstimate but off of the maths of how fast the blockchain moves because that's what determines on it reaching the epoch is the speed of the blockchain itself how quickly the blockchain is being processed and how quick it is all moving so once again folks if you need to view the community pool just come to terror station uh, go to station.terra.money and then um, just tap on that at the top and I'm already there and then just tap community pool and you can view the rest of everything else here. Always make sure you're actually on this website. You can always tap this padlock to make sure the connection is secure and the site is who they say they are. So um, yeah, let me know if the format, because I've just changed the format and left the not financial advice uh, banner right in the middle of the screen. I'm really sorry. Well, not right in the middle, but lower down. I'm really sorry about that. Um, I've made the window view uh, bigger so people don't have to squint so much to see the smaller text on the screen. Do let me know if that, if it's better, if it's worse. Let me know if the sound's too loud, if I'm talking too loud, because uh, the more time that goes on, I really want to just get everything dialed in down to a T so we can just agree on a format and that be that. And uh, as to a lot of people ask me about the Telegram group at the moment, we're trying to figure out uh, a way to make it really, really safe and try and prevent scams and people scamming other members and things like that. It's just not nice to see that happening in a group that we uh, created to help the community not to have people um, end up losing. It's, it's, yeah, it's just not nice. So as it stands at the moment, the TG group is paused for now. The broadcaster system's still up. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll be talking for it with the admins in, uh, sorry, the moderators in a group call and pretty much discussing um, how we can use bots to pretty much remove anybody doing any kind of wallet dropping, airdrop stuff or any kind of junk like that. Because as, as you grow, as these platforms get bigger and bigger and bigger, there's more users, there's more people messaging, there's more people following, more people contenting. We're going to come across scammers, haters, doppelgangers, all kinds of horrible people. And um, it's just how we react to these situations. So for now, like I said, it was better to, we pause the TG group and just, try and figure a few more things out, iron the rest of the kinks out and pretty much just keep adapting it as we go to try and make it safer. Like always, folks, beware of scammers, doppelgangers and uh, anyone pretending to be me and uh, it's not financial advice and I will catch you in the next one. Shloop.